uh, a car weighing 100 kg. Now, when you say weighing 100 kg, means this is a mass, uh, not the weight. Eh? Okay, sometimes they may use the word weighing. Okay, a car weighing 100 kg is traveling with a velocity velocities of 25 meter per second. Okay, so let's list down uh, this information. So the mass is equals to 1000 1, kg and uh, is moving with a velocity means this is the initial velocity uh, u equals to uh, 25 meter per second okay the car hits a tree and stop in a time of 0 0.05 seconds so t equals to 0 0.05 second now can any of you tell me what's the v the final velocity can any of you tell me what's the final velocity zero why because it stopped right it stopped it stop means the the velocity becomes zero okay so they want you to uh not count okay calculate calculate the impulsive force eh? okay calculate the impulsive force that is uh acting on the car so impulsive force f equal to mv minus mu over t eh? okay uh m is one thousand v zero uh one thousands u uh, 25 okay and then divided by uh 0 0.05 okay so what's the answer yes what's the answer you can't say it's 500 newtons Five hundred thousand newtons okay Yes. Okay. So, uh, impulsive force is a force. So therefore, the unit is newton. Eh? Okay. It's a force. So it's in newtons. Okay. Uh, so that is how we solve the problem. So we list down the informations. Okay. M U T and V. Okay. And then, uh, then we write the formula for impulsive force. F equal to M V minus M U over T. Yeah. Uh, then substitute the numbers or the value into the equations. Then, uh, then we get an answer. Okay.